I'm going to demonstrate using the Decimals Graphing Calculator to graph number 2, part B, on page 66. First thing we want to do is set our window. Uh, and you'll notice the default setting is on the x-axis negative 10 to 10 and on the y-axis negative 6.8 to 6.8. Our problem calls for an x-axis of negative 20 to 20. So I'll enter that here. Notice it changes it right as you type. And the y-axis from negative 1,200 all the way up to positive 100. Again, the way I access that is I clicked on the wrench. And under Window, you just type your intervals in for x and y, and you're ready to go. When you want to type your function in, you can click out into the graph to remove the wrench settings window. And then the function's entered over here on the left. Our function is x cubed minus 20x squared. And the way you put an exponent on is with the caret key above the 6. Uh, plus 8x and minus 10. And as you can see, I now have a graph of the function in the desired window. And then, of course, we're going to make a screen capture of this graph and then post it to the forum. Good luck.